Welcome mathematicians to Underwater Math. Today we will be dividing decimals using models. Here we go. Hundredth grids and base 10 blocks help us visualize decimals. Let's start by looking at a decimal and the model for it. We have 1 and 4 tenths, which is equal to 1 and 40 hundredths. Here's one whole and here is 4 tenths or 40 hundredths. Let's say we want to divide this decimal by 2. This means we are splitting it into two equal groups. So if I split this model in half, I have two groups that have the same number of hundredths in each. We have 50 hundredths here and 20 hundredths here. Adding those together, we have a total of 70 hundredths in each group. So 1 and 4 tenths divided by 2 equals 7 tenths or 70 hundredths. Pretty cool. Let's try another. Represent the division problem 2 and 7 tenths divided by 3 using the model below. This model shows two holes and 7 tenths shaded in. This is a total of 27 tenths. Dividing 27 into three equal groups gets us 9 tenths in each group. So 2 and 7 tenths divided by 3 equals 9 tenths. Now that you have had practice, try one on your own. Which model represents 1 and 2 tenths divided by 3? Is it model A or model B? Let's look at the first one together. This one shows three groups of one and two tenths. This is a multiplication problem. We have a total of three and six tenths. This is not the correct model. Model B shows one whole and two tenths divided into three equal groups with four tenths in each group. This model matches our division problem above. Fabulous work today. Keep practicing your decimal division and we will see you next time at Underwater Math.